Welcome back, Family of Light. This is Davida with Medium of the Light Tarot. I am back with you, Taurus, for another love reading for you. Now, I ask that the collective energies of Taurus that need to give information to their person to come and join us. So whoever watches this video in entirety can get a healing message that they need to hear from their higher self and their guides. All right, this one wanted to come out. I am not taking reversals. Spirit more and more is saying, don't bother taking the reversals because we'll tell you the information that needs to be said. So I'm doing it because I am a medium. So I listen to spirit in all different forms. If you end up really liking or just liking this video and it was healing for you, please leave me a like because it does help fellow Tauruses get this information for their highest healing. So do your fellow Taurus a favor and like this video. Thank you for doing that. This is the Radiant Wise Spirit Tarot and that's the backs of them. Some people are interested. I sure know I am. All right, so let's see what we got here. So those who are new to my channel, welcome. If you are unfamiliar with my readings, this is generally you, this is generally them, and this is the storyline and many more cards will be coming. Now, if I go silent, it means that I'm listening to the collective Taurus energy to get the highest healing out of this reading. Looks like you were very much into this leveling up this commitment. You have a lot of fiery passion towards this commitment and there's celebration here. Your person looks like someone took something away from them because you've got here the Ace of Wands and the Ace of Swords in the same spot. So both of you are on the same page. There's just a choice that they need to make about this loss. Because I don't think it really had anything to do with you. This was an external situation. I'm hearing something about with this moon card that there was some kind of um, investment for them that did not go well as far as someone stealing from their them they lost it your person wants justice and and they want this to move fast so it might even be um yeah a judgment and i was just about to say a um, legal situation so they might be in the middle of trying to get their money back from whoever took it, but they're definitely going towards justice. There's some legal matter. The Wheel of Fortune. It looks like it's going to go in their, in their favor, but it's going to be, um, what I'm hearing is lawn and drawn out. It's kind of put you guys at a bit of a stalemate here. Because with this, Hierophant is the devil card. So it kind of feels like, you know, things are out of your control. You can't move forward because of the situation. You know, the, here's the Queen of Wands here with this Ace of Wands. Or Queen of Pentacles with the Ace of Wands. You know, it could have possibly been like an inheritance that was lost. And both of you are planning on using that money for the next step of your evolution, you know, moving in together, marriage, whatever it might have been. You know, and it stopped short this celebration and brought in the tower moment. 
So with the Seven of Swords here, give me more information. The Ace of Wands. So you know how I was saying it's going to go in their favor. It might not be the amount that they were hoping for, but it is an offer. With this Ace of Wands here, it might make them go within or it has made them go within because maybe they were also offered something so small in comparison to what was owed them. They're like, okay, I'm going to have to take this to a court of law. And with the Seven of Cups here, choices comes the Three of Swords. So whatever, whatever external situation happened here, it really did break their heart. You know, that maybe a friend tr stole money from them or, you know, bickering over an inheritance or some kind of a money with family members, friends. With the moon card comes the chariot. So, you know, with this information, you were trying to figure out, okay, well, what's my next step? You know, do I have to sit in limbo like he is? Pretty much, yeah. This is the next card here for the Page of Swords. Both of you, while you're waiting for this, are going to feel like the impoverished soulmate couples. But remember, there's a window right here, and they can go into this building and seek warmth. So all is not lost. This is acknowledging also that you guys are a twin flame soulmate connection. On the bottom of the deck is the star card. So there is hope. So... What I'm hearing from spirit is that you are going to have to, not have to, but it would be nice if you would encourage your person when they get discouraged. And of course you're gonna be like, well, duh. I'm just saying, don't shoot the messenger, you know? <laughs> but, you know, maybe your role in all of this is being patient as you can and picking them up when they're just about to pull their hair out. Let's see here. Let's pull some of these. What is the 3D reason for all of this? What is going on? Wow. <laughs> if that's not clarifying, that's clarifying. It's about money. Wow. Sometimes spirit whew, shocks me. Sometimes I wonder, I'm like, how in the H-E double hockey sticks do they pull 3D cards, pieces of paper that are made, printed with an image on it, you know, validate a reading here? It just, anyway, side note. All right. So, anything else? No. Okay. So then, hmm. Let's pull from this deck here. Wow. <laughs> Fulfillment, money. So when I was talking about this, this was the short term where they're like, oh, well, we'll offer you a small amount. And then and your person's like, no, do I need to see you in a court of law? Okay, well, I guess I do. So, you know, and is, are you guys going to be protected? You know, if you guys have children together, is this going to be a protected situation? Yes, you're going to be fine. If you were concerned that maybe you weren't going to get this, because of this legal situation, don't worry about it. Okay. This is a pretty concise reading. All of them have been today. Now, Spirit, um, is there any question about the love between the two of them? No. But we will pull one of these. This is White Rose Guidance love or divine love messages what does your person want to say to you oh many of things apparently i feel so much beauty harmony sweetness and shelter between us well i don't think <clears throat> i don't think i don't care about you because i really do which what are you doing sorry my cat's trying to climb on me so maybe in this instance, you're feeling a little neglected because they're so overly encapsulated by this whole financial situation. But know that they're doing this for both of yours good. 
It says, give me more time. I am not good enough for you yet. What's that about? Oh. So if you are not already in a committed relationship and you are about to be and then it stopped at the celebration here, they, they really want this money to be able to provide a very secure, protected environment for you and the family that you have already created or are going to. And it says, I want to travel the world with you. So they want to have money enough to travel the world with you. Riley, stop. He wants me to feed him. And I'm like, dude, I'm working here. Stop. Bossy kitty cats. All right. Sorry. Segue. Um, let's see. Anything else that we need to say here, Spirit? Because I feel like this is pretty cut and dry. This legal situation is going to go in your favor. Everything's going to be perfect. Well, no, perfect. But fulfillment will be here. You guys will be protected. So I think that's pretty much it. That was pretty cut and dry. But know that you're going to be okay. And this is going to be something that might take a minute. Longer or two than you wanted. Said sarcastically. You know, especially um, with legal situations, it can take longer than you had ever hoped. But know that it will be okay. All right, Taurus, if this was your storyline or something similar, please leave me a comment about what your situation is on this. And um, please like it so other Tauruses get this message of comfort and healing. Thank you so much for joining me. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Bye-bye for now.